Surround sound has become today's leading format used in post-production and film work. It's also becoming a standard in music production as well. With Nuendo, you have access to some of the most comprehensive surround mixing tools available today. The VST Channel Mixer offers an advanced yet easy-to-use surround mixing environment with support for 5.1 and 6.1 formats, as well as upcoming formats such as 10.2. You also get a powerful collection of surround plugins designed specifically for processing tasks within a multi-channel format. To top off this great selection of surround capabilities, you also have the ability to encode your mixes directly from Nuendo into an AC3 or DTS format ready file, ready to go onto a DVD for production. These are available as add-on options for Nuendo. You can find out more about this on the Steinberg website. Now before we go further into this tutorial, I recommend that you take a few moments to look over the surround chapter in the Nuendo manual as there is additional information that will be useful to your overall experience with Nuendo's surround capabilities. All right, let's start with a brief overview of the main areas you'll deal with in Nuendo for your surround mixing. There are three main steps when setting up and using surround channels within Nuendo. The first step is setting up your main surround channel configuration within the VST connection setup. Once you have this done, you'll have the ability to set up a surround audio channel within the VST mixer. We'll cover this in more detail shortly. Last, you have a collection of surround plugins that you can use to provide various dynamic, time-based, and frequency-based effects to your surround channels. Let's take a closer look. Before you begin surround mixing, it's important to know which format you're going to work in. This is determined within the VST Connections page. If we open up the configuration window, you probably just have the standard stereo outputs configured. By choosing the option to add a new output bus, you can choose from the various surround formats that are supported by Nuendo. Once you have one of these formats selected and configured, you can then create a surround channel within the VST mixer. To do this, you simply create a new audio track or take any existing audio track and choose the surround channel output bus from the output selection field. You can choose either the entire 5-1 mix bus or a specific 5-1 channel. If you choose the entire 5-1 bus, then you'll notice that the channel visually changes to reflect new options for surround placement over the entire 5-1 bus. The most obvious change is the appearance of a new surround panner. This gives you a full 360 degree positional control of where the audio track is to be placed within the surround field. If you need to get up closer, you can simply double click on the panner and a specialized surround panning editor will appear. In this editor, you have an incredible dimensional view of your 5-1 surround environment and the ability to simply move the sound anywhere within the environment that you want. Several additional controls are provided to you to further fine-tune the surround positioning. You even have the ability to choose the type of diagram that's displayed. As well as the opportunity to determine whether you are editing a mono placement or a stereo placement. With the stereo placement, you can choose a different axis in which to link the two channels together when moving them around. As you can see, this is truly surround mixing at its best. To complement the surround mixing capabilities, you have a collection of plugins to use as needed. There are two types of surround plugins that are available. First is a collection of surround tools available as plugins that come with any standard version of Nuendo 2. Second, there is a special surround edition collection of plugins that offer commonly used effects in a surround compatible version. The first set of plugins are utilities used for special purposes. They are generally used on the main surround output bus in the VST mixer, instead of using them on individual channels within your main mix. The matrix encoder and decoder plugins are used for working with ProLogic compatible audio files. The decoder allows you to test how an encoded file will sound on a ProLogic compatible system, while the encoder allows you to create a two-channel version 
of a LCRS surround mix to use for broadcasting or to distribute on external media such as video or DVD. Next, we have the Mix 6-2 and Mix 8-2 plugins, which are used for mixing surround mixes down to a single stereo mix file. You have basic volume and phase control for each channel, as well as a normalize function on the main output bus. To make the collection complete, the Nuendo Surround Edition plugins offer real-time DVD mastering quality effects such as compression, reverb, 5-band high-resolution EQ, and more. All of these within an 8-channel format plugin. Each plugin also offers you the ability to apply and adjust the effects to a single channel, or to all the channels at the same time. These plugins come as a separate add-on package that you can purchase for an existing Nuendo 2 installation. As you can see, Nuendo provides you with the tools necessary to deliver professional, high-quality surround mixes. Integration of the surround formats directly into the VST channel mixer makes it easy to transform existing stereo mixes into surround mixes. By adding the Nuendo Surround Edition plugins and the DTS and Dolby encoder options, Nuendo is the only tool that you will need for any surround project that comes your way.